Captain Marvel star Brie Larson dressed up as Metroid character Samus Aran for Halloween. And now the actress says she wants to make a Metroid movie. She won an Oscar for her harrowing portrayal of a woman held hostage in Lenny Abramson's room. And now Larson is leveraging that success by entering the world of big-time franchise filmmaking. With her role as the titular superhero in Captain Marvel, the excitement level around Captain Marvel was already high, largely thanks to Larson's fan-approved casting as Carol Danvers. But things reached a fever pitch after the recent trailer release, which gave fans their first good look at what Larson will be up to in the MCU. Of course, her role in Captain Marvel will only be the beginning, as Larson's Danvers will no doubt play a pivotal part in Avengers 4. The long-term future of Captain Marvel also looks bright. Even if Larson did not actually sign a seven-picture deal with Marvel Studios as was rumored, related, announced video game movies were still waiting on if Larson has anything to say about it. Captain Marvel won't be the only iconic female character she tackles. For Halloween, Larson dressed up as Metroid heroine Samus Aran and posted a picture to Instagram, immediately stoking fan excitement for a possible Metroid movie with Larson in the lead role. It seems fans aren't the only ones who hope to see Larson take on the role of Samus Aran. As the actress herself posted on Twitter that she wants to do more than just dress up as the character to go trick-or-treating, see Larson's Instagram post and relevant tweet below. Zero Suit Samus had an evening with Harry Potter and it was cute. A post shared by Brie, at Brie Larson, on November 1, 2018 at 8.26am Pacific Daylight Saving Time video game fans will immediately recognize Larson's costume as Zero Suit Samus which refers to the Samus Aran character as she appeared in the Game Boy Advance game Metroid Zero Mission as well as later Nintendo titles including Super Smash Bros. Brawl and Super Smash Bros. For Nintendo 3DS and Wii U, the character first appeared in the classic NES title Metroid, an outer space action exploration game in which the bounty hunter Aran must battle her way through a maze-like environment filled with an array of bizarre creatures in order to defeat the evil. Mother Brain, the character appears in that game in a full space suit and helmet and is not revealed to be female. Unless the player completes the mission under a certain time limit, in which case they're rewarded by seeing Aaron in a skimpy outfit. Future Metroid games mostly drop the sexism but kept Aaron as a female heroine and she ultimately became one of the most iconic of all female video game characters. After already agreeing to tackle one of the biggest female superheroes in Captain Marvel, it's no surprise to see Larson lining up to return to space as another popular female character. Of course, fans have been clamoring for a Metroid movie almost as long as the games have existed. But getting such a film off the ground has proven to be an impossible task thus far. Most recently, director Jordan Vogt Roberts put forth his own idea for a Metroid movie, which would involve Samus Aran going on a literal solo mission, with no other human characters in the film as your Vogt Roberts is currently moving forward with Metal Gear Solid, another video game whose film adaptation has been a long time coming. So could he follow that up by fulfilling fan dreams of a Metroid movie as well? It appears he already has a willing lead actress in Larson. Should that project come to pass? Source. Brie Larson, Instagram. Brie Larson, Twitter tags. Metroid.